Hi guys, today we are going to see how you can create an Instagram page for your business. Let's say you have a business and you want to create an Instagram page for your business. You can do that easily by watching this video. So after watching this video, you will be able to create an Instagram page for your business like this, where you can add your business details and post your content like this. And when people visit your page, they can see your content. And if they want to know more about your product or service, they can use this contact feature to contact you. Next, once we create the page, we will see how you can check the performance of your page, like the number of visitors you get and the people's engagement with your content and other valuable information. So with these insights, you can easily find out what type of content works best for your business. So you can publish more such content, which can help you grow your business. Next, we will also see how you can connect your WhatsApp to your page. So when a visitor clicks on the contact button, they'll be taken to your WhatsApp and you can directly chat with them. Now creating an Instagram business page is completely free and you can use it to reach more people and grow your business. So let's get started. It's going to be very quick and easy. I'm Brian from Website Learners and let's start creating our Instagram business page. Now to create your Instagram business page, we are going to do three steps. The first step is to create an account on your Instagram page. So to create a new Instagram account, open Instagram app. This is the Instagram account which I already have. Now here on your profile, Press and hold for a few seconds and you will get these options. Now click add account and select create new account. Now here enter a username for your business and this username will be displayed here on your page. Also it will be on your Instagram page link. You can enter any username you want. I am going to enter my business name. Now click next and here you need to enter a password for your business account. So let's enter a password and click next. Then it will ask you for your phone number or email id to create your account. So select add new. I am going to use my email id so let's select email. Now enter your email id then click next. Now Instagram will send a verification code to your email. Let's scroll down the notification bar. And you can see that we have got the confirmation code from Instagram. So let's open the email. Now let's copy this code. Now go back to Instagram and then paste the code here. Now click next. Now if you want to follow your Facebook friends on Instagram, click skip. And again click skip. Now you can add a profile picture for your business account. I'm going to add my business logo. So let's click add a photo and select choose from library. Now select your profile picture. Then click here and click next. Then you will get this page. Now here press and hold and you can see that a new account is added here. So let's select it. And you can see that we have successfully created a new Instagram account for our business. Okay, once you have created your account, next you can go to step 2 which is to convert your Instagram account into a business account. By default, Instagram allows everyone to create a personal account. So now we need to convert our new account into a business account. Now to convert your account, go to edit profile and you will get this page. Here, select switch to professional account. Now to go forward, let's move the pages to the left and click continue. Then you will get this page. Now you can select a category for your business account. Since I am doing a retail business, so I am going to select clothing. Now if you want to display your business category like this, you can enable this option. Once you are done, click done. Now you can select whether you are a business or a creator. You can select any option you want. I am going to keep it as business. So let's click next. And now you can add your business contact details here. So let's add our email and phone number. Now click here. And here you can add your business address. Once you're done, 
click done here. Now if you want to show your contact details like this, which will help people to contact you easily, you can enable this option. So let's enable it and click next. Then click skip. Now here, click on this close icon. You can see that we have successfully converted a new Instagram account into a business account. Okay, once you have converted your account, now you can go to step three, which is to add your Instagram bio. Once you add your Instagram bio, this is how it will look on your page and it will help people to learn essential details about your business. So to add your Instagram bio, click edit profile and here you need to enter a name for your business account. You can enter any name you want. I'm going to enter Taylorix. Once you're done, click on the stick mark. Now here you can add your website link. So if you have a website, go to your website. Now click on the address bar. Then click the copy icon and your website link will be copied. Now let's go back to Instagram and paste your website link here. Now click here and add your business details. Once you're done, click on the stick mark. Next, you can also add your WhatsApp number which will help people to directly contact you on WhatsApp. So to add it, Select contact options and select WhatsApp. Now here you need to enter your WhatsApp number. If it already shows your mobile number, click here to select and click send code. Now you will get an OTP code. So let's copy this code. Paste the code here and click here. Once you're done, if we click here, you can see that we have successfully added our business details. Okay, now you know how you can create your Instagram business page. Once you have created your Instagram business page, next, let's see how you can post content on your page. Now to post your content, here click the plus icon and you will get different types of content which you can publish. I'm going to post a picture. So let's select post and you can select the picture from your gallery. I'm going to select this picture. Now click here and you can use these options to edit your photo. Once you're done, here click on this arrow. Now here, you can add more details about your content. So let's add the details. You can also add hashtags related to your content which will help Instagram to show your content to the people who have similar interests. So I'm going to add a few hashtags related to my content. Once you're done, if you click on the stick mark and if we click here, you can see that our content is added to our business page. Now you know how you can post content on your Instagram page. Next, let's see how your business page will look when people visit your page. So let's see your friend or someone knows about your business and they want to check your Instagram page. So they can click the search icon and here they can enter the name of your business page. Then it will show your business page. Now if they select it, they can see your page and also the content you have published. So this is how your business page will look when people try to visit it. Now if they like your page and if they want to know more about your product or service, they can click contact and they will get these options to contact you. Now if they select WhatsApp, they will be redirected to your WhatsApp account. Now they can directly message you to learn more about your product or service. And you will get their message to your WhatsApp account. Okay, now you know how people can visit your page and contact you. Once you have published some content, how will you know whether your content is performing well or not? So next, let's see how you can check your content performance. Now to check your overall business page performance, let's go back to our Instagram page. Now click professional dashboard and you will get this page. Now here, click see all. Since we have published one post just now, it has not yet reached any people. After publishing some content, you can again go back to your professional dashboard, click see all and you can see that we have got the performance insights. 
So this is our business page performance insights. Here you can see how many people interacted with your content, how many followers you have and how many people your content has reached. Now you can click here and check the performance for a specific date. And also you can check for a specific time period. Now to check your individual content performance, click on content and if we click view insights, you can see that we have got the performance insights. Here you can see the likes and comments your post has received. And you can also see how many people have shared and saved your content. And here you can see how many people your content has reached. Based on these insights, you can know which content is performing well and which is not performing well. Once you find your content type which works best for you, you can publish more of it and grow your business. Now you know how you can check your content performance. Next, let's say you already have a Facebook page for your business. Now you can easily connect your Facebook page with your Instagram business page. So once you connect it, when you publish content on Instagram, the same content will be automatically published to your Facebook account. This way, you can save your time by automatically posting on Facebook. So next, let's see how you can connect your Facebook page with your Instagram page. Now to connect to your Facebook page, click on the menu icon, click settings, now click business, then click connect or create. Now select connect an existing page. Click continue. Then again click continue. And click add Tailorix. Now you can select your Facebook page. And click done. And your Facebook page will be successfully connected to your Instagram page. Now let's post some content on Instagram. So click here to go back. And like we did before, click on the plus icon and select the type of content you want to post. I'm going to click story. Now let's select a picture. So to publish it, click here. Now click sharing options and you will get these options. Now you can select this option to automatically publish your Instagram post on your Facebook page every single time. So I'm going to select this option and click share. Now your content will be automatically posted on both Instagram and Facebook. Now if you click here, you can see that we have got our Instagram story. Now if we open our Facebook page, click here and click view story. You can see that our Instagram story is automatically published on our Facebook page. So this is how you can automatically publish an Instagram post on your Facebook page. Okay, now you know how you can create an Instagram page for your business. Once you have created your page, what if you want to invite your friends and contacts to follow your page? You can do that easily. So next, let's see how you can invite your friends and contacts to follow your page. So to invite your friends, click on the menu icon and select settings. Now click follow and invite friends. Here, you can use these options to invite your friends or anyone you want to follow your Instagram page. So that's it guys, this is how you can create an Instagram page for your business. Okay, now if you want to know some interesting tips and tricks for Instagram, you can watch this video. And if you want to create a WhatsApp business account, you can watch this video. Also make sure you click the subscribe button to see more videos from us. So thanks for watching, I'll see you in the next video. Take care, bye bye.